Hey Tankers, I'm Brendan Bluett, Audio Director here at Wargaming Chicago. Today, I'm going to give you some insight as to how we put the sound effects together for a tank in World of Tanks on consoles. First, we needed to get our hands on some running tanks. Here at Wargaming, we're committed to the preservation of historical tanks, so we've had the honor and pleasure of working with some great vehicle museums all around the world to record the real thing. Stalin's Line, just outside of Minsk, Belarus, the Military Vehicle Technology Foundation in Mountain View, California, and the Royal Canadian Armored Corps Museum in Ontario, Canada, just to name a few. In version 4.5, we expanded the variety of tank engine sound effects to include a wider variety of gas and diesel engines, all recorded from running historical tanks. The first tank I ever rode in and recorded is still my personal favorite, the AK-47 of tanks, the T-5455. The T-5455 is a Soviet Tier 9 medium tank. In real life, upwards of 100,000 of these beasts were built, and they went on to become the main battle tank for the Soviet Army during the Cold War. It was the most produced tank in history, and some are still in military service right now. These tanks weren't powered by a simple truck or tractor engine. Building on the success of the power plant from the T-34, the Soviets built another variant of the V-Series engine, the V-55. This engine had impressive specs, like V12 configuration, diesel power, 38.88 liter displacement, which is more than six times that of a Chevy 350, 500 horsepower all the way up to 800 horsepower on later models, and it all went to the ground through a five-speed synchro mesh manual gearbox. These power plants that were purpose-built for tanks were not built for comfort. They were built to do a job. So naturally, a lot of them are insanely loud. and have a pretty aggressive tone to them. We've had the opportunity to record three different T-5455s in three different countries, and the recordings are all featured in version 4.5 for tanks equipped with diesel engines in the 300 to 649 horsepower range. In order to assemble a full set of sounds for a vehicle in the game, we have to attach an array of different microphones to the tank at key locations, like the engine, intake, exhaust, gearbox, treads, and inside the cabin. From there, we roll the recorders and have the driver perform a list of maneuvers, like going in a straight line at various speeds, turning at different radiuses, accelerating and decelerating, and the startup and shutdown of the engine. The result is a performance capture of the complete tank inside and out that we can edit into audio cues for use in game. This allows the player to blend through audio perspectives around the tank and in the tank at runtime with sample accuracy from zooming and sniper mode. Beyond that, we also record fully of the exterior and interior equipment on the vehicle to get isolated single shot bumps and rattles of all the unique ammo crates, racks, fuel tanks, radio equipment, and other gear. The result, when it's all put together, a recreation of what the real life vehicle sounds like while underwater.